Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name is David and this is a Magic Review. Hey, today we're gonna to look at four quarters from Magic Belay. Uh, what is it? Uh, it's basically Magic's take on the $100 bill switch. Uh, this bill switch is done with a mismade bill. Kinda looks like the bill that's there on the front of the DVD. And if you'd like to see what it looks like, this is it. Something cool. This is you have you have a dollar bill on you by any chance? Uh, I don't. Give one bill. I'll, I'll let you borrow mine, but I always like to look yeah, at that. I Perfect. That's all I got. That's cool. Let me just ask you a quick question. Let's say you take this dollar to a deli and ask for change. What do they give you? That's exactly what I'm looking for. Don't take your eyes off it. All right. I'm gonna fold it like this, and you're gonna see the one dollar bill change right before you can look wherever you want. Look at this. Look, you see it? Do you want to touch it? Just to make sure it's not a laser print. Is it really inside out? Yes. There's no tape holding it together. I'm gonna to bring it right back. Watch, watch it close. You ready? Once, twice, three times, four. We're gonna bring it right back. Look, right back to normal again. You see this? Isn't that great? You can keep it. Take it. Take it home with you. You do whatever you want with it. Well, that's four quarters back to one. And that, my friends, is four Q. All right, so that was Magic Belay. Uh, you might remember he did Centrifugal, he did Multiplying Soap Bubbles, he did CIA. Uh, like I said before, this is his version of the $100 bill switch. Uh, and uh, it does use a utility that most magicians have in their pocket. Uh, this DVD was put out from the New York Magic Project. All right, so what I liked about it. What I liked about it is it allowed me to learn a new bill switch. Uh, I already knew one, uh, but it wasn't uh, very clean. It didn't end clean, and so uh, I wasn't really a big fan of it. Uh, I had first seen Copperfield do it. Copperfield did it uh, on one of his specials, and uh, I kind of learned how he did his, but I did mine just a little differently. I did want to learn how to use uh, the utility with the bill switch. Uh, mine originally didn't have the utility, and so this was a really fun routine to learn how to do. All right, so a couple questions we always ask about all of our magic reviews, the first of which is, what's in the box? Uh, what's in the box, you get the DVD, and you're gonna get the mismade bill. Uh, you don't need a mismade bill to do this trick. You can certainly do it as uh, the original $100 bill switch where you just change a, a one to another denomination like a five or a 10 or a hundred. Uh, is it what I thought? Absolutely. Uh, I knew before getting into this uh, what it was. Uh, most of the uh, $100 bill switches are similar in style and theory, and so I wasn't surprised, but it was fun to learn the routine. How are the angles on this? Uh, you can pretty much do a full 180. You're not going to want anyone behind you, obviously, but I think 180 degrees is uh, perfect for viewing this effect. Can it be inspected? Absolutely. The, the bill is real legal tender, and there's nothing there for the spectator to find. All right, so what's the overall quality and production value of the DVD? You're getting really great over-the-shoulder shots. You're getting over-the-shoulder uh, reveals, and you're getting these really cool over-the-shoulder live performances. You get to see from Magic's viewpoint uh, what the trick looks like when he's doing it live. And so I think that's really helpful. I wish more magicians would do that. Uh, I think that was really great. He's giving you lots of time, lots of ins and outs. And uh, the thing I love about um, his teaching is he gives backstory on this and he gives credit for everything. He gives credit for everything and it really makes this uh, an enjoyable DVD to watch. All right, so how much practice does it require? Uh, you're gonna need to do this in front of the mirror until you get your angles and you're just your beat and your rhythm down uh, perfectly. Uh, I think anyone who's done a bill switch before is gonna have a little bit of an edge on anyone who's never done one, but I still think it will require some practice and uh, just spend some time in front of the mirror. How much setup and reset is there? Uh, very little, uh, it's just folding and refolding the bill. In fact, once the trick is over, you're pretty much set up to do it again. All right, so what are the positives for this? Uh, this is the ultimate packs flat plays big. Uh, it packs really flat. It's crazy looking and it looks like, it looks like it ends clean. All right, so what are the negatives to this? Uh, the negatives are it ends dirty. It ends just a little dirty. Uh, there's probably some ditching that might be involved, but other than that, it's a great, great effect. Very few negatives, wonderful trick. All right, so is it worth your money? Uh, it's 25 bucks, so that's really cheap. Uh, you're getting the 34 minute DVD and you're getting the mismade bill. Uh, I got mine because my bill was wearing out. Uh, I had one from a long time ago and the more you fold it and use it, the worse it looks. Then you gotta go and find another one. So if you gotta buy a new bill anyway, get the DVD from Magic Belay and learn his routine. Uh, if you want to upgrade 
and really get a book about the $100 bill switch, you're gonna wanna get the hardback book, Switch, by John Lovick. All right, so who would like this? Anybody who does money magic, especially bill magic, uh, and anybody I think who wants to learn a, a really cool new bill switch. This is four quarters from Magic Belay. I got mine from penguinmagic.com. I suggest you do too.